video. I am. Oh. Hello, everybody. I'm going to give you some tips on how to catch croaker. All right, so what I'm using here is a little kingfish rig with a one-ounce sinker. And me and my friend Jake here, uh, we're using, uh, I'm using uh, blood worms, and he's using, what are you using, Jake? Cut mullet. Cut mullet. And we're, catch we're going to show you how to catch some croakers. Okay, you got to do it quick here, buddy, because we got to go. Now what I'm doing is I'm just putting on some blood worms, one on each hook, and just hook it twice. One, two. Last one of the day. And this is the last cast of the day. So, let's see if I can get some fish. I'm fishing here at the inlet. It looks like Jake has some. I usually wait five, two, no, two or three minutes, and then we usually get something. But uh, if that's not working for you, uh, you just bounce it a little bit, and the coke will go for it. Um, and here today, they're catching blues, uh, fluke, a uh, couple spots, a lot of coke. So if we wait a couple minutes, I'm sure we'll catch them. Yeah, we're fishing at um, in the little inlet when you come into Bethany Beach, Delaware, and uh, just right here, people down there fishing under the bridge. Last time I was here, a uh, three-foot sand shark, and but they're not doing too well with the blues and fluke this season. So uh, hopefully we'll get some nice coverage. Oh, there's something on this. They're getting the uh, bluefish and fluke on uh, little bucktails, and if you use a uh, little jig head and you put on Zoom Super Fluke Junior, that's going to catch you some fish. Let's see this, buddy. That's a big little fish. Well, let me get a, a shot of him. Uh...